What's up YouTube? This is Victor on the Let Me Explain show and today we're going to do a review of this um, green test. Um, it's um, actually a gadget that accurately detects dangerous nitrate content in more than 60 types of fruit and vegetables. Now I chose to uh, pick this gadget up and test it out, see how it works and use it in my in my life generally because you know we can't trust the the labels put on food in the supermarket so I chose to put this in my armor of good health so we're gonna take a look at the gadget itself and break down uh, how it looks how it works and also have a general overview, overview of my first impressions of it over time I will do uh, reviews on food that I pick up from different places and I'll name the places so that we know what type of um, uh, food they're serving especially uh, places that claim to serve organic food what I'm also interested in doing is picking up food from the farmers market and testing it out and seeing if it contains any nitrates now for those who aren't familiar with it it's um, nitrates are basically um, chemicals that, that are found in in fertilizers in chemical fer fertilizers so my my general theory is that if if somebody is using a, a chemical fertilizer then they're open to trying anything to boost their yield which then renders the food uh, non-organic um, so that's why I bought this to to try it out now this gadget is also based on on the maximum daily intake of, of, of nitrates as recommended by the World Health Organization and we'll see how it goes and and uh, break down the the technical aspects of it and see if it's worth the buy now let's take a quick look at what's what else is in the box so obviously you have the the device Oh, I, I love it. It's powered off already. So I left it for a minute and it powered off. So that's great for saving the battery. One click and it powers back on. There we go. So that's that. Like I said, the power button is up top. Your probe is down here. And it feels pretty solid in the hand. So that's good. Um, you power that off by holding the power button so that's that it's got a micro USB port on this end for charging obviously and let's see what else comes in the box you got your warranty card the manual is mostly in Chinese which is interesting we've got the English version and unfortunately no Mexican or Spanish you know, a version to it which I think would have been ide ideal for America for the American market but a small bag where you can store your probe in that's all good and then we've also got the USB cable for charging it and finally we've got the charger itself and um, you power it on yeah. so once we're there we can then select what we want to test it could be fruit veggies meat and these are our settings so the test screen is not really that responsive but you know for 130 bucks what do you expect um, so this just gives you the legal terms the setup guide and so on and so on so let's go into the setup guide so basically it's showing us how to how to take off the you take off the cap and clean the probe with the with wet and dry tissue so that you get an accurate reading on that so that's pretty straightforward you power it up you power it on and see that's it so let's get into it and see if we can start testing so the I'm gonna be testing fruit we're gonna start with a banana what else do we have we have a nectarine a banana an avocado yeah we've got three items to test so we're gonna look for our 
our item we want to test grape pineapple mango apple yeah we're gonna test an apple too so why don't we start with an apple so on the screen already it's telling me that um the normal will be uh, 60 milligrams per kg per kilogram and so to test I have to insert the probe into the fruit and then press start let's get into it totally exciting so that's our apple <laughs> of course that's the apple and it um, says it's organic and um, this is the pink lady so we're gonna take our probe dip it in and then press test ready okay let's get the angle of the camera right all right so we've got the probe in remember 60 milligrams per kg so we're gonna hit test and off it goes so this has got um 30 less than 30 low nitrate con content means product is safe all right the apple passes the test Awesome. So now we're gonna clean off the probe. I just have wet tissue, so I'm not clean up the probe. But just for, for experiment's sake, let's do that same apple again from a different angle. So press angle, apple, <laughs> and then take our apple, take our probe. There you go. And we'll press test. Okay, we got the same result from two different uh, points, so I guess it's um, consistent. I'm not saying it's accurate, I'm just, I'm, I'm working more on the consistency of it at this point. So now we're gonna do a different fruit. Let's try a banana. So once again, we're gonna so once again, we're gonna look for our fruit. Uh, this time we want to look for the banana. The test test screen could definitely uh, do with some work. So with the banana, it says um, the normal will be 200 milligrams uh, per kilogram. So let's see what this one has. Again, this is certified organic fair trade. I'm gonna probe it. All right, we got it, the probe in. We're gonna press start. 100. So this also passes, um, it just hits the halfway mark. So basically I would say it is a fun tool to have in the kitchen if you're shopping at a new place or if you just want to go through your your food source, you know, test the, the, the food from your favorite supermarket. I think it's a handy tool to have um, in your kitchen, in your home. And so it comes recommended for me, but before we go, we're going to do a final test. Uh, the avocado, my favorite fruit, and see how it, how it fares. All right, so we go back in and we look for our fruit, avocado. I wish they, they put it in alphabetical order because it's... Or maybe even a scroll button at the at the side, you know, where you could toggle up or down and just scroll through. I know a touch screen sounds fancy, but and there we go. That's our avocado, and um, so with the avocado, it's expected to have a normal of thirty milligrams per kg. That's really low. So we're gonna probe it. Hit test. So this one has um, less than 30 and it passes so that's awesome all right so this has been victor on the let me explain show i um, giving a brief review of this uh, gadget the green test and um, i hope you found this video useful if you did find it useful please leave a thumbs up and a comment below if you've used one of these and also i'll leave a link below where you can get it on amazon it is quite pricey it comes in at um, about $130, but I think in the long run, it will be worth worth the money you spent on it. 
if you're interested in the quality of the food you're eating. All right, this has been Victor on the Let Me Explain Show. Thanks for watching.